again, we just want to work on him being able to soften. And then when I go to leg yield him, I want to shove him over with my inside rein. I can, see I can, but I'm going left. So I want to get a soft feel a little more, or I'm going right. So I want to open that right rein. I want him going to this leading rein, not because I'm shoving him over with this opposite rein. When I pull on my left rein, it should mean go left. Not my yield right. Good. And we'll work at kind of a short serpentine. Again, working on him softening and bending. That's what's just hard for me to work. Leaning on my hand. And I'm not there. I wanted that left foot to switch the swing. So if you embrace there as we go to change direction. I'm in a small circle. I'm real close to my one rein stop. I'm about 80% of the way there or so. So I could help him. But for him, a lot of it is again, it's more so just starting to relax and be able to bend his head with something not holding him so tight. Letting him be able to explore down there. my right range shorter than my left, so if he got scared, I could take his hind quarters here and stop him. And I guess that wasn't just for demonstration purposes. It was also because you'd rather stop him before the trouble comes in. I don't want to take him so far into trouble that he gets scared and I need it. And if he does get scared, I want to know I have something there. I don't want it the first time I do it to be in the middle of a wreck. I want to do it a bunch before the wreck so that there's some understanding. 